Good morning. It is 6.43 a.m. on October 7th, 2016. I'm Christiana Ellis, and I just got up. This is five more minutes. So, took Luna to get her teeth cleaned yesterday, and it turned out that one of her molars did have, I mean, it was alarming. They said it was fractured. Um, I'm not sure how that would have happened. She just crunched down on a rock or something. Um, but, uh, they did have to extract that and, uh, yikes, pricey. Um, I mean, I don't doubt, like, I don't think I'm being cheated or anything, but it is still, there's, you know, a sting to it. It's like, ee. um, but you know, hopefully she won't have to do it again real soon. And, um, I'm also, you know, thankful that, uh, I was able to afford it, but still, it's just one of those things. It's kind of like fixing your car. It just sort of feels like it you shouldn't have to do that, or I don't know. Anyway, uh, little pupper's doing fine. She was a little uh, woozy from uh, the anesthesia when I picked her up yesterday, but um, she's doing all right now, so I've got pain medication and antibiotics for her for 10 days, and uh, I need to buy some pill pockets because the um, antibiotics she doesn't think are so good. Um, the pain thing is chewable, so she eats those just fine. Anyway, she's doing okay. She's a sweet little dog, as always. It's Friday. Um, oh, yeah. The other thing I was going to talk about is just continuing with my elbow, and it's it's really frustrating in the sense that it is not resolving into one of two obvious solutions, right? So there would be one possible path that it could go down to where it just starts feeling better and it's fine. And it's like, oh, yep, just a bruise. It was fine. And then there would be another where it's like starting to get stiff or it stays really swollen or just really, really painful, in which case it's obvious, yeah, I should get that checked out. But instead, it's kind of just staying stubbornly in between. Like, I can move it fine. There's no issue there, and it doesn't even hurt much. But it does ache a little bit, just kind of all the time, just a little. And... uh you know, just like the, the, the bruise element of it seems like it's not improving. Like it's not discolored or swollen, but as I've said before, I have actually completely broken bones before and I did not swell up all that much. Um, so that's not necessarily a good indicator for me. I don't know. I mean, I could just go to an urgent care center and get it x-rayed, I suppose, but it just also feels like if it's just a really minor thing, what are they going to tell me to do? They're going to say, okay, well, you know, put some ice on it, rest it, don't work it too hard. And I'm like, yeah, I'm kind of doing that already. And then they said, okay, well, however many dollars, please. I mean, I do have insurance, but it's dumb. So it's just one of those frustrating elements where, like, I don't know. I, like, is do I care? I, or like, is it bad enough to actually do anything about it? I don't feel like it probably is. And yet it's also not improving quick enough that I can just easily dismiss it altogether. It's an, It's annoying. And I am occasionally feeling a little bit of like tightness in my, the tendons of my wrist. But for all I know, that's really just happening because I'm sort of doing weird stuff with my elbow. Or maybe if it's swollen just a little bit, it's stealing. I don't know. And it's also off and on enough and minor enough, even when it happens, that I'm not 100% sure that I'm not just paranoid. stupid it's stupid stupid elbow stupid bus driver making me hit my elbow on the pole 
stupid me trying to rush to sit down without securing myself and making sure I was stable when I knew that the bus could start going again at any moment. Everything's stupid. Except Luna. She's she's adorable. It's a fact. Alright, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow for five more minutes.